Hey everybody, Mike Burner back. Um, getting ready to cut up a piece of this. This is some store bought fatwood here. I think I got it at Rural King. And uh, it's good fatwood. Um, I've been spoiled by the use of the pack pals at Smith's Tender Maker. And I decided today to skip using it. And uh, I'm going to shave up some of that with my. William Collins Blackbird and uh, make some fine shavings and we're going to build a real big fire but I'm going to do it the old school way without the cheating and using that pack pal go ahead and get a little bit of it peeled up here You can see it's good and translucent down in there. It's sticky as can be. I've never wrapped that up or bagged it up or anything. So, it's probably losing strength. Now I'll make some fine savings. I have to take alcohol back to my knife and it's starting to get some sap on it. Get it all. Round it up here. Two done. Didn't get the one and done, but need to stay in practice building building them without relying on that tender box. That makes it easy. It's almost like cheating. But it's definitely sizzling. It's black smoke pouring off of it. That is some really good uh fat wood. And uh Need to buy me another box of it for long. I'm going to dedicate this fire to Tommy from the. He used to be the open air fish market. Now he's he's changed his name. It's to the. He's the enduring patriot. He's been in the hospital for a few days, and. Uh, him and Reed is going through a tough time, and like I said, if you would say a prayer for him or or send good vibes his way, and uh, hopefully he gets out of the hospital soon. And uh, Tommy's a great fella, but it's about burn up already. And with that, I hope everybody has a good weekend coming up. And happy Fatwood Friday, everybody. Thanks for watching, and uh, take care and God bless.